Hi, I'm Amy Cassandra Martinez for Red Carpet Report, and we're in Hollywood for the 2018 Radio Disney Music Awards. I think he's recording, but I want to double check. There we go. Ah, uh, got it. I know you're so freaking talented, but gosh, your hair is so amazing. Thank you. So what is it like for you to be here? You know, like. We loved you on America's Got Talent, and now coming over here. What's that like? Yeah, it's crazy. After America's Got Talent, I didn't even think for once that I would be here today. RDMAs and like all the stuff I've done. It's just been a crazy and amazing journey. What has been the most surreal part of it all? Uh, the most surreal... I think the fact that when um, fans come up to you, they'll like just be like, you've inspired me like inspired me to do like whatever their goal is and it's just like so touching to me you know uh, what's the weirdest place you've gotten a fan to come up to you oh the weirdest um i went to the bathroom and i walked out and there was a fan right there <laughs> and i was just like hey no personal question like out of out of the restroom, like the stall, or like the yeah, actual, like, like like the whole bathroom, not the stall. Okay, I'm yeah. like, damn. No, no, no. no I okay. can't. Yeah, it's after I came out of the stall. Yeah, it was just, it was just like one of those things where it came out of the stall, and you're like, hey, and you're like, oh, hey, hey. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But you know, I love my fans so much. Exactly. Yeah. Um, what was the most crazy part about being on America's Got Talent for you? The craziest part, um, I'd say. Probably the finale round. That was crazy for me because I had to create up a whole routine in one day because the next day was my rehearsals. Oh my and um, it's one of those things when you're making up routines for the round next, you don't think of the routine afterwards because you never know if you're going to make it. And so I had one day to make up a whole routine and I was really frustrated, but actually my frustration is what made my routine. Nice. Sometimes when you put it in a in a position where there's a lot of pressure, it's kind of like make or break, and that's when like yeah. the good stuff comes out, you know? Yeah. In fact, actually, my finale hoop part when I whip around the hoop, um, I actually created that because I was I was outside and I'm just like, oh, I can't come up with anything, and I swung the hoop around and I was like, that's it. That's it. I got it. And yeah, that ended up being my finale routine and finale move. So what's next for you? Where What are you doing? Um, well, right now I'm traveling and performing and I'm part of this YouTube show called Boss Cheer. And it's, been, it's about a cheer show. I mean, it kind of explains itself a little bit. And yeah, it's really fun. It's kind of like my first... My first real acting, like I've been on the Zardvark as like a guest star, but um, I'd say this was more um, like a scripting stuff and things like that. So. That's so exciting! And now last little question, who are you most excited to see tonight? Most excited? Hmm. You know, I saw Lele Pons on the carpet and she follows me on Twitter, I really want to see her. Oh yeah. yeah, we just spoke with her, she should be over there. She's yeah. really nice. So I really want to meet Lele. Oh, I thought yeah. was well, have fun tonight. I hope you meet her. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, and in the comments down below, let me know what do you think the song of the summer is going to be.